How's it going guys? Hey Bones here, coach of your Vancouver Cougars, and today as you see we are right into the battle here. Um, I made a uh, team builder, but it ended up not going through with sound. So we got Mudsdale, Leftovers, Salt Rock, Body Press, Iron Defense, Rock Slide, Polytoad, Damp Rock, Drizzle, Scald, Ice Beam, Toxic, Encore, bring the Ludicolo, Life Orb, Swift Swim, Hydro Pump, Ice Beam, Scald, and Giga Drain, Mel Metal, Choice Band, Double Iron Bash, Ice Punch, Earthquake, and Thunder Punch, Spectre, Heavy Duty Boots, Shadow Ball, Hex, Will O Wisp, and Haze. Now, looking at his team, he has brought almost every. He brought Gullosapod and Araquanid, and he did not bring no Garchomp. So that means, other than the Zero Aura, I have a pretty free. Uh, Switch or uh, wow. Okay, I'm gonna lead. Could be a bad lead, honestly. But I could lead uh, Polytoad. I'm thinking that it's gonna lead Araquanid. Um, okay, so no Garchomp. Brought the Galissa Pod. I think that was everything that I hear. I think he... I didn't see if Act Flareon was there. I thought Flareon was going to come. Which would be kind of surprising, to be honest. My team kind of wrecks Flareon. But then again, it's going to be the unexpected winner of this game for some reason. Okay, so we get the... We get that right. Alright, so the Politoed is in... My headset is extremely loud, and you know what? I, I, I bet you that my El Elgato is really loud. Okay. So. I'm going to Toxic because I have no reason not to, other than if he goes into uh, Lucario. Alright, so we're Toxic in this thing because this thing is annoying AF. I'm gonna put up sticky webs. Yep. Those sticky webs kind of sucks, actually. Um. But we're gonna encore in case he wants to attack or do something else. So he's leftovers. Now, the only thing that I'm really worried about speed wise is the zero right now. Um, switch into Mudsdale. Okay, Sticky Ups is an issue. I didn't. Th I don't. I didn't really think too much about bringing. Well, to be honest, but I honestly, I have absolutely, I actually have absolutely no removal on the team itself, so that is a problem. Um, so the Decidueye comes out, and that is kind of a problem. We're gonna find out if this thing is special or physical, I guess. Um, I do want to go for probably a stealth rock. This thing might set up on me, to be honest. Okay, just gonna knock off. So, he's gonna knock off our leftovers. We're gonna get some stealth rocks up. So, now I guess we are forced. He does have removal on his side. The Decidueye. Um, so. Um, definitely able to go into Mel Metal here. This goes for the Leaf Blade, which is fine. It does a lot of damage, to be honest. A lot more than I thought. It was. Oh, it was a crit, that's why. So he might knock off, knock off too. 
Um, I don't think I have any other reason I could go for a nice punch, kind of hits everything. Go for Thunder Punch. Okay, just go for a knockoff. Which sucks. Knockoff is annoying. Spirit Shackle. So he's just gonna get as much damage off on this thing as possible, it seems like. Mm. Oh, we can no longer escape. Mm. If you're gonna get an ice punch off, it should take it out, to be honest. Alright, so we got one KO. We have taken out the Decidui, which is really good for our um Hunsdale. Okay, there's just Lucario's here. Um, if I want to switch out, not really. In case this thing decides and wants to set up. Go for an Earthquake. Okay, so let's just go for, for the Aura Sphere. Okay, so then goes the Metal Metal. The rain does stop. We will go into Politoed now, I think. Um, we can definitely throw off Scalds here. Alright, so the water comes back, which is sweet. Okay, so we could go into the Araquanid. Let's see. Yeah, he did bring the Flareon. Okay, so I'm going to Scald. <clears throat> I don't entirely care about getting, um, getting him burned, but this, this uh, scald in the wa in the rain is going to hurt a whole lot. <clears throat> and getting him to switch out is nice. There's the Raquanid. So he has not boots, it looks like. So he is, oh, he is water absorbed though. He is water absorbed, so that's kind of interesting. Actually, that's not, that's pretty pretty good prep to be honest, actually. <clears throat> um, Don't have the best switch into this. I like to see what he wants to do, to be honest. I'll go for an ice beam here. <clears throat> so he's just gonna toxic. to throw off another ice beam. I don't know what he wants to do. He's gonna withdraw. And goes into Zero Aura. He's gonna take the rocks damage and he's gonna take an ice beam. <clears throat> I was debating on toxicing. Oh hey that's huge. Um I'm going to switch out into Mudsdale here. Dang. Hit thaw out, because usually it's either usually the one turn thaw out or, or what, so. But either. Being frozen is either really broken or it's not. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna literally go for an iron defense here. That sucks. It sucks a whole bunch for him. Like honestly, like, freeze is literally the one most broken. 
Okay, so he's frozen in the back. So I'm gonna go for an iron defense. He's gonna take some rock or rocks damage. Um, and I am going to probably go for a rock slide, because rock slide you probably take it out after uh two rounds of toxic. <clears throat> So rock slide, rock slide should do a good amount. So he's going to just toxic, just fine. And we're going to avoid that, which is unfortunate. Absolutely unfortunate. Okay, um... Still gonna go for another rock slide. I don't really can't really afford to not do a rock slide in front of this thing. It's for liquidation. We are plus two. We will tank that. And we should hit this rock slide. So down goes the Araquanid. Which is now we are free to use water moves. Now, what did I just do? Rock went in. Okay, there we go. Okay. So we are up 5 4 now. Okay, so we have a frozen zero aura, which is nice. So I, I gotta remember, I got, I can't scald. Not gonna scald. Um, I'm hoping that we actually don't run out of communication. He's just trying to pick a Pokemon. Okay, so he doesn't. Um, going to throw up a body press. He may just want to just attack me, which is fine. Dark Pulse. Okay, so down go. Hunsdale. I'm going to get up rain again. Scald because I don't want anyone to bring in um Zerora. I'm gonna ice beam. Okay, so he's got a nasty plot actually. Yeah, that's kind of scary. So he is not um and now I'm gonna scald. Sphere, this should probably take me out. Okay, so this means I can go into Spectre now here. And I'll just Shadow Ball. Could go on, gone into Ludicolo to be honest. Which is probably what I should have went for. Oh, okay, so down goes Lucario. I'm 
which was a big threat, huge threat. Lucario is scary. So he's still got a frozen Zero Aura, and nothing else outspeeds the Spectre. And we are modest. We are hitting Shadow Balls extremely hard right now. Um, okay, so yeah, he's got the Golisopod, so he's probably got Aqua Jet. Um, I will throw off a Shadow Ball. I don't know if he's banded or what. Okay, so he's got the first impression. But it's not going to take me out. It's not very effective. That still does a whole lot. Okay, so now goes the Glossopod. So this might be a clean sweep. I don't know. Glareon doesn't get any um, priority on their quick attack, and Zero is still frozen. So I would say GG's to Zach. We are going to get a W here finally. Um, so he's still frozen. Um, it is he is faster than me still. So there's a chance that he can unthaw, or we are still faster than him. GG's. We all are going to take a finally and get a W. Uh, unfortunate fr fr freeze because they're all kind of like kind of put a damper on my team. The Flareon should take some rocks damage. Yep. Not heavy duty boots. So we'll hit a Shadow Ball and we'll take this dub to the house. <clears throat> oh. Alright, we're gonna get a communication error. I don't know if he uh put out of it or what. Alright, so I guess we ended up just disconnecting, but I don't think it entirely mattered because um, uh, I just shot about once more and basically the game was over. So anyways, that was our game for week three. Uh, we ended up taking a W, uh, Spectre ended up cleaning up, and we'll see you guys in week four. See ya.